morning. It's Sunday, June 17th. Happy Father's Day to all the fathers out there. The title for today's lesson is The Wine of Her Wrath. It has been said that the Bible is a tale of two cities, Jerusalem and Babylon. While Jerusalem stood for the city of God and his covenant people all through the Bible, Babylon has stood as the for oppression, violence, false religion, and outright rebellion against God. Think, for instance, of the Tower of Babel. The Hebrew word for Babel is the same word in the kingdom of Babylon. Peter sends greetings from the church in Babylon, which is generally understood to mean not from the ruins of the old kingdom located in today's Iraq, but from Rome itself, soon to be the church's oppressor. This is an interesting application in the light of the book of Revelation and the role of Rome as presented in it. There is no question that the power that Babylon represents as depicted in the book of Revelation is greatly corrupt with this corruptive influence extending across the whole world to some degree or another. The phrase, the wine of the wrath of her fornication is clearly a reference to false doctrine, false teaching, and corrupt practices and the end results that come from them. Babylon is a force for evil that has spread to all nations. Hence, everyone needs to take heed lest they be corrupted as well. Look at the world today, the corruption, the confusion, the oppression. What should this teach us about our need to be anchored in Jesus and His Word? Thank you for watching today. God bless you. Continue to pray for our ministry. And again, Happy Father's Day.